Technology is transforming the world of healthcare. We now wear wristbands to record the number of steps we take, our heart rates, and our sleep cycles, but so much more. Today, diabetes treatments have also changed considerably as patients become more tech savvy. New devices and technologies have emerged to help manage the disease. Here with the top trends is Elaine Kelly from Foracare. Good morning. Good morning. All right, so let's talk. Well, before we talk about the top trends, because I know you brought some tools here, let's talk about diabetes. You know, national epidemic. There are 30 million people, or 10% of the population that have been diagnosed with diabetes and another 86 million mm -hmm. people that have pre-diabetes, which is elevated blood sugar levels, but not quite to the diabetes diagnosis. And there's two types, right? Type one and type two, expand yes. on that. Okay, type one is usually diagnosed at a young age and it's where the body just does not manufacture enough or any insulin. Mm -hmm. And type two is normally diagnosed at an older age, mm -hmm. but not always. And there are risk factors associated with it. And that lack is- Lack of exercise. Lack of exercise, being overweight, having a family history of type two diabetes. But they both really do affect lifestyles. Of completely. course, of course, because once you have a diagnosis of diabetes, uh, you need to be able to change your lifestyle so that you can manage your disease. It's about diet, exercise, rest, and learning how to test your blood sugar and knowing what these numbers mean. And let's talk about the testing and numbers because we've got some great advancements that are making yes. it a lot easier for everybody out there to manage their diabetes. So tell me what you have here. Okay, so this is our blood glucose meter and it measures your blood glucose. Okay. And it is a Bluetooth enabled device. So that means that the data in this device automatically communicates to our smartphone app. Okay, so show me how it works. Okay. So you take the meter, you insert the strip, it automatically turns on. Okay, and then you're gonna take your lancing device. Oh, it talks okay. to you too, thank you for using it. It does, it speaks I in like English that. and Spanish. Please apply blood, it's telling you what to do. So you're gonna prick your finger. Okay, so I've got a little bit of blood here. Perfect, and I know it's pretty important to place that blood right on that strip. Okay, so now it's gonna count down. Oh, I love this. Look at this, how cool. So tell me what's happening here. 110 milligrams per deciliter. Okay, so this is my after meal reading, which is gonna be a little bit higher than a pre-meal reading. And so now what you'll do is you'll see that it's importing that information into the smartphone app. <gasps> And There's there my is. reading. 110. It's in green, and that means I'm within range. It really tells more about the story of how well you're self managing your diabetes. It keeps the history it of all the readings. It keeps the history of all the readings in here. This is one of the charts that I use the most. Does and it give that, you like an alarm, like uh, be careful, something maybe an alert? Well, our telehealth system does. So Good. this device automatically communicates this data into our 24 7 health view system. That system is a remote patient monitoring system that is used by a physician group or a clinic so that they're monitoring patients in between visits. And so they have more of an idea of what's going on with the patient. And what I love also is the fact that when the reading comes out, if a mom wants to know how their child is doing in school, shazam, she gets the number. As exactly, because it's broadcast into the smartphone app. Now, what happens if you don't have a phone? Because I know some, you know, some elderly people that don't. There are a lot of people that don't have smartphones. And so we have, this is a gateway. This basically acts just like a communication device. It has a cellular signal, just like a cell phone. All you have to do is plug it into the wall. Oh, fabulous. And then the readings from the meter automatically broadcast into the telehealth system. All right, and this is a blood pressure? Yes, two out of three diabetics have high blood pressure. So then they can just, well, help me here. So Go around, okay. Up, exactly, and then all you need to do is press the button. And that's also gonna be stored on the cell phone. Yes, so this is stored in the app, and you can see as it's measuring in the app. Now that is super cool. So whatever my reading is comes out on the cell phone. Right. And also can alert my physician or Exactly, and then you can also see trends in history as well of your blood pressure because the app has charts that show what your readings have been. So a quick reading of 117 over 82, which popped up right there on the cell phone. Exactly, and then you can see charts and graphs as well, and you can put notes. 
and kind of remind well. yourself of exactly. what you had. Pulse or, reading too. Exactly. This is great stuff. You know what I like the most? I mean, this blood pressure machine is fabulous, but I mean, I know way back when doing this was so difficult for children. Now it's really easy. It is. It is quick, easy, and painless. And anyone that has kids and has stepped on a Lego knows that is way more painful than doing a blood glucose test using our lancing device and our meter. I like that analogy. Thank <laughs> you. That was a good one. Uh, for our viewers out there, Elaine, who'd like more information on these products, where can they go? You can go to foracare.com, our website. And if you'd like more information on these products, once again, the website foracare.com, and you can go to our website, thebalancingact.com.